A year before the nation elects its next president, a new poll shows that a majority of Americans believe the country is heading in the wrong direction. That poll also finding some voters would prefer to have Democratic and Republican nominees who are not named Joe Biden or Donald Trump. ABC's Justin Finch has a closer look at the numbers from Washington. President Biden in Delaware touting more than $16 billion in new infrastructure spending his administration secured for Amtrak. I've been fighting for this for a long time, to invest in Americans, not just America. But the latest ABC News Ipsos poll shows 76% of Americans think the country is heading in the wrong direction. Economy, 74% of Americans say it's very important to them personally. 69% say the same about inflation. Those are issues in our poll that tend to favor Republicans. More polling from the New York Times and Siena College finds Republican presidential frontrunner Donald Trump, who now faces 91 felony charges, is outperforming Biden in battleground states, Arizona, Michigan, Nevada. Nevada and Pennsylvania. We need to put every dollar and every bit of energy into winning in November. Trump appearing at the Florida Freedom Summit with several of his Republican primary opponents. The brand of Republicans has become toxic, very difficult to attract people uh, to the party. So Florida has shown the way forward for the Republican Party. Meantime, Republicans who qualified for Wednesday's third debate in Miami, Florida, are preparing to make their cases to voters. Trump, once again, not attending. While the Biden campaign insists it's not worrying about polling and insists Biden will win re-election in 2024, the Trump campaign is praising former President Trump's rising numbers, saying it's building a state-level operation to win the Republican nomination and defeat Joe Biden. Justin Finch, ABC News, Washington.